Kennel from the Raw Advantage. Welcome to day one of week four. Once again in Bear's beautiful backyard here. After a few weeks of being here, I finally scouted out this tree. First I thought it was an orange tree, but it turns out it's a loquat tree. I'll show you some of those suckers that are really delicious. They almost taste like canned peaches. It's crazy. Anyhow, enjoy. Planting mission. Cool, thanks. Yeah. That'll be the most likely spot, but the more places I hit, the better chance. A little moist down there. We're lucky. Alright, so we've got the raw pizza ensemble. We've got the crust. Got all the greens on there to keep it from getting too soggy. Got the pizza sauce. This recipe will be in my new transitional recipe book coming out in the next month or two. Mmm, pizza sauce. Move out the sauce just a little bit. Fancy schmancy. Zucchini. This could have been marinated and dehydrated to make some crazy, like, fox bacon. Ooh. That's good, and now we got some fox uh, caramelized onions. Fake caramelized onions. Oh my. <laughs> the best foods are the messiest. Blah, blah, blah. All right. Now we have a mix of finely chopped grape tomato, sun-dried tomato, and a little bit of the cashew cheese. Mm. Oh my. Cashew parmesan cheese in the hoose. Transitional recipe extreme. Look out. I gotta say, this is a gourmet, low-fat, raw pizza here. It's pretty sweet. I'm pretty stoked. Just the final touch here. I made a lot of cashew cheese here. I think this is gonna be a pretty cheesy recipe. Cheese is good, cheese is good. This is gonna be served for eight people, and this is a total of about a cup of nuts in total. And the whole recipe, including the flax crackers. I think it's gonna be great. And there you have it. Bam! Sun-dried tomato pizza. Uh, Slice. Yeah. No. Uh, <laughs> okay. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Is it good? Killed it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hell yeah. Bravo. Wait till you try it, man. It's amazing. Ah. Damn. It's so good, right? It tastes like a nacho pizza. Mm. Man. Yeah, like it wrong. Got fruit. Oh! <laughs> uh, Double pizza crust. Big meal of Mexican pizza. And two stews too! Woo! Oh yeah. Layered with spinach and arugula. And add the toppings. Guacamole. And salsa. Oh, aren't they just beautiful? Three pads on my own back. Thin crust sucker. Curry stews the bomb. Damn! Curry hitting it up, what's going on? Oh, that's a bomb, it's so good! Oh, yeah, it's a... <laughs> Mmm. Where's the cheese? No cheese today. <laughs> it's good, dude, but I'm telling you, it's not as flavorful as the other one. Another one? So, Bear says the first pizza was better. Refer to that recipe. And it needs the cheese. And it needs oh. cheese. No cheese. We're in his book premiere. Let's see if we'll get him in a little bit. Amazing portraits of famous skateboarders, actors, and musicians. Mark Gonzalez. Steve Barrow, Eric Costin, Ethan Suppley. I gotta get him in there too. Mark Weber. Mark is not the answer. Let's see if we can get Mark Weber in this. I like the bar. Gino Ayo Chico. Fun job. Congrats, man. Thanks. That was really. Here's his book. It's a big success. Travel back. Going to the park. Day 24. Road game escape for fun. Steve Barrow. Oh. Oh my. Jim Greco in the house. Oh! That was so bad. Sick, yeah. man. Sick. The gym, man. What do you think about the raw food? Beep. Greco on the raw food, man. Got some sports drinks here. You can hit some of that too if you want. Some sports drinks. Skating. Ripping around. Chocolate monkeys in the house. Yeah. Bear practicing at the bear. Tra more transitional recipes for my next book. <laughs> a favorite. Tom Yum Soup. Yum. Mac and cheese noodle. One of the best. Little Isaac enjoying. Got month one under wraps. This is day 28. And it's day 28! Give me, man! Yeah! Yeah! 
That's going in there. Don't ever, ever use that. <laughs> I'll erase it, I swear. No. <laughs> Don't get it twisted! <laughs> Celebrating a month of these. Oh. Got some cheesy zucchini butternut squash noodles. What does everyone think? That shit ever had. Good. Favorite. Yeah. New favorite. Yeah, this is my favorite thing you made so far. There we go. New recipe. Wow! Right here, what do we got here? I got uh, myself a case of strawberries. Organic mangoes and organic strawberries. Oh yeah. Here we go, we got some coconut apple pie. We got two durian. Delicious, I love it. What do you think, Ray? We got durian lever in the house. Do it, I'll show you how to open one of these suckers. Here's a little button on the bottom. This one has no cracks in it. So what you're gonna do? Bump a few times. Really drop it. Watch your bare feet. Just as if it was falling from the tree. Mmm, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh god, this is good durian. Straight up. To the world of durian. We got a good one. Do is you follow the cracks. Natural openings and you just grab your fingers in there. There's the blessed durian. Really good one. Oh yeah. Durian's open and it tastes like freaking pudding in there. King of fruits is ready. Got tongue. I'm gonna try some durian. First time? Yeah. Yeah? Oh. Really good. It's good, hey? It's sweet like pudding. For more. You can't stop. Well, and here's some of this stuff too if you want some. Apple pie. That's by customer. Yeah. Apple pie and durian lunch. Yeah. Oh my. It's like putting on a pod. Solomon hitting it up. I love it. Zach doesn't like pudding. They're scared of the pudding for Zach, huh? You gonna try it, Danny? They're in. Pork me up. Most animalistic fruit you can eat. Ryan, be friends with the durian. I'll try. Be friends with the durian. This is the one the guy won't eat, right? This is the one, this is the one that sits in Yeah. You want a spoon or a fork, or do you want to be animal? Ew! What do you guys think of He loves it. I love it. He's kind of on the fence. It looks so. like scrambled eggs. Just bite it. Durian. Right? Yeah. <laughs> durian, taste one. Take two. Pretty damn good, eh? Yeah, it's good. It's like sweet like pudding. Freaking pudding, there we have it. Chanel going for it. It's like one sorbet. Hey, a second bite. <laughs> Just to make sure it's alright. We're lucky, man. Two damn good ones. Happy day. Durian day. Best day. <laughs> that is first try, yeah. Good. I ate a fermented duck egg. I think I'm <laughs> afraid to eat some fruit. Friend Cole here is going to try a durian for the first time. What do you think, Cole? I'm scared. Cole's scared! I'm giving it an 8.5 out of 10. Yeah, that's good! It's not bad. I gave it a 9 out of 10. It's good. It's good pudding. It's pudding fruit, guys. It's it smells scared like, of durian. It smells like ass, but it tastes like custard, creme brulee custard fruit. It smells like hell, but it tastes like heaven. That's what they say. It's the king of fruits, one of the only fruits that kills people. Falling over the trees, yeah, yeah. dropping. Jack for a I'm sure a coconut would drink right. Yeah. Oh! If I was you, man, I'd just, I'd just grab a whole chunk and shove it in your face. I don't know how to eat this yet. Man. You just, you just grab it. Good. This is crazy. It's good. Bad? It's so weird. It's like... You also have some white sapote in the house. I'm going for multiple bites. Oh, it's so nasty and so good at the same time. <laughs> Bob, first try of durian? Yeah, very first try. It's alright? Yeah, Mike. Mike? People who love it, love it. Hewn, there we go. Uh, I like it. You're only the second person in the place not to like it. It tastes like red onion pudding. Hey, Steve, it's day 29, man. We got white sapote. That's weird. I'll try that first. That's good. Pretty dope. Dirty I'm scared about the trend of the durian. Everyone liked it almost. Eat this quick. Not a oh. fan. Not a fan of the durian. Coconut apple pie. Terrible. You don't like that? Uh huh. No. I literally yeah. want to throw up. Yeah. I'm trying to spit it out. Yeah. Oh my god. It's horrible. <laughs> 
or for me and <laughs> Ray. You can have all you want. Eat it all. It's my favorite. What do you think of the apple do pie? Do you really like durian? I love it, dude. Uh, the apple yeah, pie is great. It. Apple pie, great. This other thing, great. Durian. <laughs> DJ Ray, Ray Raw, and me from uh, Good For You Not Melt is uh, <laughs> the only only lover, the only real lover of durian in the house, and everyone else enjoyed it and tried it out, but. No. During power. During power. During power, during lovers unite. Here we go. Cheers. Cheers.